I have Daniel sleeping, which is amazing. I don't think he's going to sleep for very long without me, but I'm going to attempt to make um, a healthy-ish type of dessert. I actually found it on my profile page a long time before I even started doing this YouTube channel. I actually started going through all of my recipes because I was huge into Taste of Home and I had a lot of extra magazines and so I went through them and pulled out the recipes that I wanted to make someday. Well, I, I put them on my profile page on Facebook under the notes and I never made them. And I was doing some cleaning up the other day while I was taking care of Daniel and I saw this recipe for banana chocolate ice cream and I went, ah, I've got bananas that are going bad this is the perfect time to make it. So since Daniel is sleeping for a few minutes, this is really easy to put together. And I had a bunch of ripe bananas that I stuck, stuck in the freezer two days ago. I'm gonna try to make it. I'm gonna try to show you guys before Daniel wakes up and then we'll have kind of a healthy-ish dessert tonight. So I have my bananas here, just a little bit of salt, cocoa, heavy cream, and then sugar if after I taste it, I feel like we need it, but Pete's gonna go ahead and open those all up for me. And then we're gonna put it in the food processor. So we ended up microwaving the bananas just a little bit, see if we can peel their skins yeah, off easier. You know, maybe in hindsight, looking back, we should have taken the skins off first before we froze them. Hey, Is that better? Easier. A lot easier. Okay, oh. don't squish the banana though, okay? Because I need mushies. that for the... I don't know how to do Top. that one, so I'll just okay. do this Yeah, just one. peel off the skins, and then I'll put them in the food processor, okay? Careful. Mom, is it um, okay if that little stuff on the side? Um, I might want to try to peel it off a little bit. Although I suppose it's just all banana. These are just falling apart. Yep, just gentle with them, okay? Okay. Are you going to try some, Charity? No, I already brushed my teeth. Oh. So. I don't know if it's going to be ready tonight. I guess it depends on, because it has to freeze if it's going to be like ice cream. Where is it going to freeze in? This is going to be ice cream. It's the, uh, like a healthy-ish kind of ice cream. We'll call it ice cream. Ice cream used What do we have? Two left? Two left? Okay. And then we'll put in our heavy cream. Because we're doubling the batch, we're going to do a half a cup of cocoa. And then I Lydia, carefully pour How a half a cup. How Where's much the half a cup measure? Right in the middle? Half is, look on this side, right here. One half, right there. You see that? Okay. One. A little bit more. A little bit more. That's pretty good. Is it right at the line? Whoa. Yep. Okay. And Pete's putting the cocoa in. Ooh, yeah. Can I put it in? Yeah, very carefully. Pour it in. Yeah. I mean, Yay. how easy is this, guys? It's very easy. Ooh, the cocoa powder doesn't even get wet. And then we're just going to put a pinch of salt in there. Oh, can I put it? Oh, can I put it in? I'll tell you what. Pete can put in a pinch, and you can put in a pinch. Pinch, pinch. Why do you need a... Why do you need And then doing it... Are we going to add sugar? No, we're not going to add sugar. We're going to blend it up and taste it first. Um, and if it doesn't taste sweet can enough... I sometimes bananas are really, really sweet, so... Uh, let's see, that goes over here like that. And we'll go ahead I and... I can't get the lid on. Yeah, we're going to have to scrape it down because not all of it's blending in there. There you go. Okay. There we go. Let's see what we're doing here. Maybe I need a little too much. Well, you know, it's hard to tell when you're making a new recipe. Can I video? Ah, sure. That would be very helpful, Lydia. Thank you. We better turned it on while we are doing it. Well, it has a safety on it, so it there. won't turn on. That's okay. Here we go. Now. Ready? We could have fed the bananas in through there. Ah, maybe. I guess if we made this enough, you'd probably get really good at what to do and what not to do. Yeah, I think you, you could have fed a You put a couple bananas in there and then when it gets chopped up, you put a few uh, more. A few more. Are you going to have to add ice cubes? Um, no, because we're going to... The, the bananas are already frozen. So what we're going to do... Or we'll just put it outside. We'll put it in a container. I said to put it in a container and then put it in the freezer. 
Oh, freezer downstairs. Yep, that's what we're gonna do. Yeah, it's mixing it just slow, and it says you'd have to. There we go. You'd have to scrape down the sides. And maybe because we made a double batch, it's a little bit. Be yeah. here, right here, Lydia. It's looking better. See oh, that? Yeah. It is looking almost yes. like ice cream. Okay, so we're getting there. Yes, yeah. it is. It's getting there. And it might be really tasty, too. Oh, are you going to taste it yet? Yeah, yeah. we got to get all the bananas squished Ready? in there. And then can I turn it on? Not yet. Hands off, please. Hands back. Okay. Thank you. And then can I turn it all on? right, push it towards me. Okay, that's the pulse. Shaking. It's the. Oh, Peter, it says if it's level right there with the triangle. Ooh. I think it's almost done. I see it spinning around in there. And a few chunks left. I don't know if our viewers can actually see that. A little dark in there, Maybe if we turn on this light, they'll be a Well, thing. we're almost done. Ooh, look at that. Yeah. Can go get a spoon? Well, let's see if all the chunks are out of it. Well, oh, there's a chunk there. I'll get a spoon. Mommy, you could add chocolate chips into it. You know, that might not be a bad idea. Chocolate you know chips what? and you then you could add nuts. Well, Charity doesn't let, care for nuts, so I wouldn't yeah. do that because we want Charity to be able to enjoy this too. Yeah. Here, Mommy, okay, I well, got it's got to go a little bit brown. longer. I got three spoons. Oh, you know what it takes for me in there? Well, that's what we were just saying. Or peanut butter. Like peanut butter swirls. Yeah. Or put almonds. Almonds. Ooh, it's looking good. All right. Let's see if this is done yet. Ready? It looks like ice cream. It does look like ice cream. Can I have a little bit? It tastes like ice cream, too. You have me in the picture? Yep. Here's a little for you. Hang on, Lydia. I'll take the camera. You taste your... Mm. What do you think? It does taste like ice cream. Doesn't it taste like ice cream? Mm -hmm. Wow. I don't think that needs any more sugar, do you? No. No, I don't think it needs any chocolate, either. If you put any sweet sweetened things in there, it would be so it should be sweet in there. Yeah, that would be really sweet. Pete, would you like to try some? Sure. Okay. Oh, here. Okay, we got a clean spoon for you. All right, let's have a little taste. Those are there yummy. Go, Pete. Tell just... me what you think. Where's my spoon? Oh, it tastes really it. good actually. Isn't that really good? So what we'll do is we'll freeze it now, it just makes me want and to then know. hopefully we can have a little bit in a little while. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yes. Thank you for your help, you two. It makes me want to eat more. I'll go ahead and write this recipe. It's super easy. Um, I'll put it on, I think I can put it on my parts, my webpage. And you guys can try this out for yourself. You can saw, you saw it was really easy to put together. Tastes really good. And we didn't need an ice cream freezer. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this up, get it in the freezer, and we can have it for a little while later.